My name is Ali Okamura and I am the owner and operator of Propagate, which is a plant shop in Midtown Sacramento. We've closed our doors to letting people in just to keep everyone safe, but we are offering virtual plant shop experiences, which is essentially meant to offer the same experiences if you were to come into the shop, but we're doing it through video chat. So you can sign up on our website for 20 minute slot of time and then we call you on FaceTime or Instagram video chat for people that have Androids. And it's resonated pretty well and has actually been a really efficient way of doing things because we get to actually see the space where people want to put plants and give recommendations based off what we can tell with the lighting and understand their level of expertise. Everything is done contact free. So you pay online and then we set your order out. You text us when you're on your way, we set it out and we wave to you from the window. We've gotten a lot of positive feedback. People seem to be really grateful that we're offering it and the gratitude definitely goes both ways because we love what we do and the fact that we are able to continue doing it is honestly just so special and we feel really lucky. It's really just about maintaining our community and being connected with our customers. That's the thing that matters the most to us. Keep engaging with us, you know. The great thing about the virtual sessions is you don't even have to buy a plant. It's also meant to serve as a place where people can ask questions about their plants. If they need to help doctoring a plant or tips on how to repot something, we're here for that. People now more than ever really want a house plant because they're they're home all the time and it's therapeutic to nurture and to see something grow and you're responsible for that. When you look at it, it makes you feel good and it makes you happy. So it's perfect for a life in quarantine, definitely. I know this is really scary, but there are silver linings that can be found and I think it's probably pretty easy for a lot of people to find it. I don't want to minimize the negative impact it's had on a lot of people's lives, but there are silver linings to it and if you can try to focus on those things, I think that you'll come out stronger when this is all over.